By the way, is everybody ready for go missions? Yay. Yay! Woo! Ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, SpongeBob. Nah. Let's all enter. Do you not Are use your legendary bug? Oh my god, please don't ask me that. Sorry. We banned him <laughs> from doing that. <laughs> It was, okay, where's the uh, was a real, Twitch? There's a real question, totally, man. I get, <laughs> I get asked that 19 times a day. <laughs> I mean, it's cool looking at it all. I was just curious. So Rindar asked me while I was streaming if uh, I had to choose between hitting Aurora Peachy in the face with a pie or one big pear, who would I choose? There's no hesitation. No, no, no. I said, who would you save? You don't get to hit them with the pie. Who did you choose? What kind of pie. Who do you save? You have to choose. <laughs> well, Obviously. No Can you answer the pie? Can I do what? <laughs> Could you answer the pie? You want to save the pie from getting hit, <laughs> hitting somebody? That would have been acceptable, too. How about, yeah, the three of us sit down and eat pie? Okay. Yeah, I like pie. I don't want to hit so anybody. Either that's a mess. Pie or pear pie? Pear pie pear. sounds like a really good Peach pie would be fine too. I bet Aurora has a bunch of peach pies. I have yeah. so many peach pies. Mots to keep sending them to me. I was gonna say I found out yesterday that Master <laughs> just automatically <laughs> sends <laughs> all peach pies he gets to. Group to one, the Quagan has left the building. Group one. <laughs> oh. In, in which so more creep, in which I said you get peach pies, wooden potatoes gets those little pearls. I need to change my name to Charge Lodestone. They are inks in the game. <laughs> and what were those? What were those clam things that they sent? Oh my us? God! Somebody sent me. You were saying about somebody just sends you clams, and then someone sent me five stacks of clam cakes. Yes, I got clam cakes too, and those are worthless. Yeah, I just that's, sold them. That's why you got them. I just sent one potatoes, potatoes, and yams. You need to change my name to Dusk. <laughs> <laughs> Add a little accent. Duske. 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 French. Duske. 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 You're such a Duske. <laughs> Duske bag. I'm following Blaze. Is that wrong? Probably. No, that's right. You can trust me. You can't trust him. I don't trust you as no, I can't. Right. You wear socks and flip flops. I can't trust you. And you shouldn't be throwing anything. Oh, are you, are you from oh, Seattle? No, it's worse. <laughs> He's in the Midwest. It's worse. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that he wears socks and sandals? He lives next to he has he has he did. <laughs> This is all we talk about raid. One well, it is cold and no one entered to wear sandals. Why would you admit that? Because I wear socks and flip flops. Because he, he, he doesn't and see I'll the problem. And I'll never let him live it down as long so as he does not with that, You don't look down at your own feet and go, EW! <laughs> oh, no, I don't. Don't your toes re re rebel with the little uh, thing in between them? Bog gets it. The thong. Gets it. Do you wear, like, normal white socks, or do you get, like, the yes, cool white stylish socks? socks? Oh. White socks. Like, we're talking like, okay. stylish, maybe. Almost ankle. Two yeah, sport. I or not and you're like, high, you're so. like 20? No, I'm 19. What 19 year old wears socks and sand and flip flops? This guy. I am not <laughs> a common 19 year old. I have. I do not understand young people for a reason. Do you, he, he is he's really. Do you, he's really 42. <laughs> is your favorite candy Werther's Originals? No, Twizzlers. <laughs> oh gosh. There's little prunes in a socks can. With sandals, but. He will not wear. He only wears mandals. He will not what? wear. Can't wear those. What is that? I don't know what that is. I don't even know what that is. Mandal. It's like a flip flop, but it's a strap that goes over your foot. Yeah, he will not wear a flip flop or a sandal so that goes between slides. the those toes. That's normal. He says if you he, go between he's, the he's, toes, then he says you're not a man if you wear those. I agree with him. But he, he wears he, he wears sandals with socks. Okay, but see. I, I, my nephews wear the soccer slides with, with socks, and I can't stand That's it. what I wear. I can't stand and that, it. Well, see, but that, I, that, that's okay to a degree. I understand a that lot of people if do they that. play a sport and they have cleats, and so they're like, yes. they have their socks, they have their 
Yeah, and they're going to the sport to put their cleats on. Yeah, sure. Right. Makes See, sense. Functionally, that actually works, but with a yeah. thong and a sock, that just bunches way too much. No, but like my, my nephew went to my dad's dentist office, and my sister took a picture of him in the dentist chair, and he had his soccer socks and slides on. I'm like, no, you're the dentist office. Just come yeah. from a soccer game? No, he didn't. He doesn't even play soccer. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Some people what a freak! Some days it's fine to just slip into them. You don't have to tie any shoes. It's perfect. I used to have a pair that had these, like, little rubber pins in the sole. They hurt like hell of a freaking. They were a pair of slides. And random fact, I did win the foot race in flip-flops. With socks? Who else was racing? Because you wear yeah, them all the donkey. time. You, you know how to, you know, maneuver. Exactly. Not, so do you, do you gotta make it to the end of the race while still having two flip flops on. So I'll, I'll even it. go. I'll even go as far as say, all right, if your if your socks and flip flops at home, okay, it's one. Do you wear these out? Not if I'm gonna go out and be with people. If it's like I'm gonna go run a very quick errand, then yes. Okay. Like I'm okay, going so, down to right, the grocery store and getting one. cereal. So <laughs> if you're going out with your friends. <laughs> You have the the forethought to say I shouldn't do this, right? Well, yeah, because most likely we're going to be going to someone's house or out in the wilderness. You're going to go the out ladies. in the wilderness. <laughs> you I live in and... northern Minnesota, guys. Going to go. There's lots of woods, He's guys. What do you want to do tonight? I don't know. You want to go in the wilderness? <laughs> well, like go to a bonfire. When you live in northern Minnesota, yeah, yes, that's, that's an option. That's normal. <laughs> That is a valid option. What are you talking about? That's an option in Seattle, too. You guys yeah, call it the But wilderness? then you're just going to get wet. It's no, less I'm, of an option in I'm Philly. I'm throwing out an example. <laughs> hey, Fenris, you want to go to a bonfire? Yeah, I'll wear some, like, shoes. On, like a on First Street? <laughs> wear shoes at the bonfire. You can light houses on fire. So Little Miss was quiet during that whole thing. Socks and flip-flops. Little Miss, give us your opinion, please. Uh, Keen Sandals, thank you very much. What? I don't know what that is. Aw, that's so sad. No, no socks in my Keen Sandals, my amazing Keen Sandals. Is that a brand? Oh, it's like Sounds a, scary. a shoe that's kind of open looking. Well, Keens are the, the type of sandals that, you know, you can stub your toe and not break one. You you to basically, them. it covers your toes. Oh, uh, uh, they're like they're 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 dad shoes. <laughs> dad sandals. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Guild Rush. We're about to turn into two different creatures because we're going to do two rushes back to back. The first of which is little bears, and we're going to race to the end of the rush. And the person that comes in first place gets to name a creature or animal of Tyria that the person that comes in last place or people who don't finish have to make a noise like on voice chat for the internet to make fun of. We're going to type in Guild Chat. When you come in first, second, third place, etc., so there's no cheating. Failure to do so will also have to make the noise. And winners of previous weeks will have a penalty to their start time. And currently we have age with 20 second penalty. Gift, Rioser, Blaze, Rindar, Matsta, and Fenris, all with 10 second penalties. Good luck. We're all counting on you. The people with no oh penalties gosh, in Damn it, now I have five, to four, three, two, one, go. People with 10 second penalties in 4, 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, you son of a nut, no. Barry! <laughs> Goodbye. Wow. I might let you win so I don't have the penalty in this oh, round. Oh, we forgot oh, that rule. Oh, yeah, if you, that's a rule. Yeah. Yep. Can't yeah. do that. If you, uh... Oh, okay, never mind. I'm not going to lose. It counts as a loss. There's too many rules. <laughs> we need a handbook. There are rules script. for a reason. They're meant to be very Actually, like actually the real rule is don't get caught doing it. Oh. Yep. That's the so rule. what you're trying to say That's... is I could accidentally fall off the cliff. Mother Fletcher. That's the unofficial rule. It's only cheating if you get caught. The noise <laughs> is going to be a risen quaggin trying to buy a drink. <laughs> like an alcoholic drink? You choose. It's up for your interpretation. For he you gave you the parameters. And me, you interpret. Not alcoholic. Sure, you didn't yes. want to add more adjectives to that, like left-handed, maybe, or. <laughs> oh, he was going to a church or something. And he has one shoe on, but there's a story behind that. So. <laughs> and he's wearing, and he's wearing socks, socks and flip-flops. Yeah. <laughs> I died. 
I don't know. The less complicated, the better. This score heals you. Right One now. of my characters in Guild Wars actually has. I just died, so you're probably falls. safe. He. So you make poor choices in the game, also. Side. Yeah, it's my character dressed in a bathrobe, socks, and flip flops. <laughs> God damn it, Blaze. Well, see, that makes a little bit of sense, right? You might have had a cold floor, so cold that Here, socks no, didn't quite. Like, no, no. Well, he has a bathrobe no. on, so he just came out of the shower. The floor is cold. Did you guys listen to a bunch of David Bowie today? Nope. I did, however, play Motorhead a fair bit last week, or a couple weeks ago. Play what? I binged on Motorhead last Motorhead. week, too. I'm just going to hit Motorhead? every trap. I hope that's okay. Motorhead. 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 Remember, Blaze doesn't know what that is. Motherhead, actually. Motherhead. 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 Say it again, Blaze. Motherhead. Motherhead. <laughs> okay, well, Jake Carster, congratulations for winning the rush, and the noise you have chosen that Rex will have to make is a risen quaggin that is trying to buy a drink. Whenever you're ready, sir. I need alcohol now. <laughs> I thought you were doing Java for a sec. Yeah, a little bit Java, kind of Java. Well, Quaggan kind of look a little like Java, don't they? Yeah, they do. They're oh. they're hut-ish. They are. They're like mini huts. <laughs> mini huts. Quit revealing the secrets of Guild Wars. Now I want to play one even more. A little hutling. Agent of people week. with no penalties in five, four, three, two, one, go. People with ten second penalties in four, three, two, one, go. This is one where you can not go through a flag very easily, so keep that in mind. Son of a berry! What kind of berry? A poison. Berries and cream. Berries and cream. Boysen. Boysen the hood berry. <laughs> hey, yo, easy. We're catching up to you, Lori. I like when people call him Lori. I know. And he raids with me, too. Oh, Lori! No! Lori, where's Carl? <laughs> Coral. 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 This is our raid conversations like every single night we're getting to. Well, that now outfit changes. Outfit yep. Passion Wars is important. In game and in real life. Apparently not for some. If they wear socks or sandals. True. That is fashion. It's bad fashion, but it's fashion. Mm. I just put my hand on my face. It's my fashion. I'm robbing my face right now. What are you wearing? Pajamas. <laughs> Ooh. Who are you asking? Who are you wearing? Is you like here start? all of a sudden? Would you like to know? <laughs> if Brainiac coming in saves Aurora from having to make the noise, gonna, Bog is going to be I'm pissed. I'm going to cry a little inside. <laughs> uh. All right, congratulations to. I almost called you Lori. Congra Congratulations to Wandering Savior for winning the rush, and he has chosen that the noise that Dr. Brainiac has to make is a Quaggan's last words before he dies. Whenever you're ready, sir. Tell the Quaggan. Quaggan love them. Somehow I knew you'd uh, say that. Oh, no, you yeah. made it sad. <laughs> and the award goes to... That wasn't funny, that was sad. <laughs> Thanks for hitting me. Quaggan's dying aren't funny. Wow. Quaggan well, goes means... toward the light, Carolyn. Fruit. 